So today I want to show you makeup with my unfavorite products which I hate, which I don't like and which I will never buy again. I already uh, make this uh, beautiful hairstyle by myself. The first product which I hate is foundation by NYX Cosmetics. I bought it uh, when I started uh, my makeup career and uh, I tried a few times and I immediately right away started to hate this product this is full coverage foundation by nyx cosmetics uh can't stop won't stop it's um uh, drugstore cosmetics so you can buy it not for much money but um, actually i don't like it I think better if you will save uh, money and you will buy good foundation by Chanel or Dior, but uh, not this one. I couldn't work with this product anymore. So I already mixed uh, two different colors and I'm applying foundation on my face. I will use this sponge and I will do like tap 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 why I don't like this foundation because because of um, when you apply it it looks it looks nice but after 30 minutes or less it it become more um, ugly I think more ugly and uh, as you can see, I had uh, redness over there and it's full coverage foundation and I think it's, it doesn't work good here because you still can see my redness and um, I don't know, I don't like my face with this foundation but i want to add that it is very blendable foundation it doesn't stuck you can blend it very well this foundation has matte finish but i don't see my matte finish on my face because it's like natural natural to glowy finish i think it doesn't look like matte so second my own favorite uh, product is Fashion Fair stick. It's foundation stick and I use it like contouring. I have dark uh, shape, but it's I hate it. I hate it so much. I don't use with my clients, for myself. I don't use it all. You couldn't blend it. It's terrible. It's terriblest, the terriblest thing ever. Let's apply it on my face I like this shape I like this color but I don't like how, how how I have to use and work this product with this product it's it's oh my god I just look I I try to blend it but I couldn't it's it looks like um, sticky and oh my god how how i can work with this i think product must be universal you can use your foundation like concealer you can use your foundation if it's dark color like contouring uh, and this is its foundation stick but as you can see i buy dark color and I wanted to use it like contouring, but oh my god, I think I can do blending a few hours, just to look, since time it's become better. <laughs> As you can see, I tried to blend uh, this product over there, but uh, okay here it looks okay but here i couldn't do it i don't know why 
what's happened <laughs> but i tried to blend it and i couldn't what is that i don't like it i a little bit blend here this product sells sephora so this product is not just for makeup artists that's for usual people who want make makeup and it must be easy easy to work with these products but i spend a lot of time to to make my contouring but i don't like it still i still don't like it and i have to work here with sponge and i think my foundation go away here because i i don't like it i don't like it i just don't like it i have to work with brushes with sponges make a lot of layers of this product to make my my cheeks so my next product is ukrainian makeup products it's ukrainian brand unico i bought it in ukraine they have website i was ordered it in ukraine when i was in ukraine they don't have as i know they don't have like uh, offline store and it's multifunctional pomade for face makeup so you can use it for lips, for cheeks, for, I don't know, brows, uh, for eyeshadow. I hate it. I don't like it all. I tried a few times and I don't use it because um, actually it has very, very nice smell, but I don't know how to use it. I like this color. I, I don't like this co consistency. It's... Um, it's oh it's already dry <laughs> just a few months you can use it wherever you want but no i don't like it it has a um, pretty good color it's pretty good but i couldn't uh, blend it blend it if i want to use it on my cheeks i couldn't blend it so let's try it's very pigmented I have to leave for my cheeks maybe 15 minutes to blend it. I will work with brush. And I started. I like this cheek, but I don't like this cheek. I don't know what's going on. Let's go for the next one. Next product is Revolution Brow Soap. I don't know why it still exists because this soap, it's um, hard to work with this product because when you apply it on your brows and when you try to to glue it like this uh, you can see that your eyebrows change color to your foundation and uh, there is uh, small pieces like dirty and it looks very bad I usually activate this soap with Tony I just spray it here and I make like this for activation Let's go. I don't like this consistency because it must uh, to dry out a little bit and uh, I have to wait. You can see this looks so wet. It looks, I don't know, it's white. It's white stuff. It's so wet very fast right now so you have to work with it very quickly don't spend time for other things just to do your eyebrows nyx i don't like it it's um uh, it's so good. i've tried a few times and uh, it's just uh, stay on my shelf with other cosmetics which i don't use 
So first, let's go to press it powder. I don't like um, final result after using this uh, trio. I also don't like working with this contrin. I I have to blend it very very much because I don't know it's kind of sticky on my previous products on my cheeks and forehead blend it very well the next product uh, it's uh, Tom Ford eyeshadow I don't like this all eyeshadow because um, it's hard to work with I think most of you will not agree with me because of this product. It's the worst product ever, which I have ever used before. But this is my choice. I like uh, more AliExpress eyeshadows than this one, but it's expensive eyeshadows. I think it cost maybe $120 plus taxes. And uh, I think it, the price is overpriced and it's, it doesn't worth it. First one I will use just like highlighter. Next color I'm gonna use this kind of red. And I will put just on my lids. Okay, you will ask why I don't like these eyeshadows with these rich, luxury, famous and expensive eyeshadows because I couldn't work with it. I couldn't blend it and it, when I put on my creamy eyeshadow it looks like messy, it looks like sticky, it doesn't blend it well. So I couldn't work with these eyeshadows. I can work with a uh, different type of eyeshadows, but I couldn't use this one. I tried to do quickly my eyeshadows, but as you can see, it's already stucky and I tried to blend it, uh, but I couldn't. I couldn't blend these eyeshadows with each other to make it beautiful and... Uh, oh my god. I don't like my look right now, oh my god. <laughs> It's very dusty, as you can see here, it's dusty eyeshadow. So I have to fix my, my eyes <laughs> because it's, it's terrible. This is me. I still don't like my eyes and uh, I'm planning to make uh, eyeliner and I will back shortly. Next product, it's mascara by Ilia, Ilia, I don't know how to pronounce it, but um, it's it's not full size. It's a sample. It's like travel version, but uh, it's terrible. It's kind of vegan cosmetics. Uh, I really appreciate it, but I don't like uh, this texture. I don't like this smell. I don't like this uh, finish. I don't like this brush. It's uh, it looks like that. We are going for the next product is lip pencil. This is by Glam B. I actually bought it in Ukraine in a drugstore. Uh, it's like few dollars. It's a doesn't blendable product. I don't like it at all. This stuff is very useful and it goes with every pencil it's, it's a good idea i like it but actually i like this color it's very pretty color it's it's fits with my eyes i like it uh, i usually like to do like uh, ombre lips i blend my pencil and then i put my lipstick and then i can add some glossy stuff while i blend my lips 
I want to add that uh, I have a platform where you can support me. This platform is named as Buy Me a Coffee, so you can buy me a coffee and donate me wherever you want, if you want. Uh, you can support me as a creator, as a makeup artist, as an influencer, as a blogger. And these donations will help me create new videos uh, with high quality. This link uh, will be under this video. What do you think about my lips? I like it. I actually like my total outfit, but it's not finished yet. I will use drugstore lipstick, which I hate. <laughs> Uh, I bought it on the sale, maybe it, it was a uh, few dollars, I don't know. I was um, pissed off when I tried. This is Cover Girl Exhibitionist Ultra Matte. Just uh, remember this package and don't buy it, never. Oh my god, it's, it's crushed. Oof. Oh, that's terrible smell. Oh, it's it's crushed, yeah. Nice. I tried it a few times and uh, I started to hate it since first few seconds, actually. Oh, it smells so bad. I think it's, it's expired. Honestly, I like it more just lip pencil, what was before, than with this lipstick. This is my final look. What do you think about the results? What do you think about my makeup with this product? And what do you think about this product, which I mentioned before? Do you like it or do you agree with me? Also, feel free to share your thoughts with me in comments. I will read it. I want to ask you to subscribe me, to follow me in my social media, in Instagram, in Facebook, wherever you want. I will put all links under this video so you can watch them and thank you for watching this video, I really appreciate your support and don't forget to like!